I'm pretty excited about our first guest. He drove all the way from New York. Yes, I know, he can drive crazy. We might need to zoom in a bit. So everyone give a warm welcome to Stuart Little. Um, sorry, who are you? Sorry you asked for Stuart, but he couldn't make it tonight. He had some complications. Oh. So instead, I'm here tonight. And you are? I'm George. I'm his brother. His oh. human brother. Oh. Um, sorry. <laughs> yeah, honestly, you should be. I don't know why everyone is so obsessed with him. He's awful. <laughs> what? Does he, like, leave his box of cheese on the floor or something? I wish that was it. That sick fucker doesn't even like cheese like that. <laughs> Mom and Dad make him the same meal they make me. Same portions and everything. I'm all for equality, but why the fuck is a mouse getting roast beef and a side of mashed potatoes for dinner? I mean, I don't really get how that's such a big deal. Such a big deal? This fucker drives a boat, a car, a plane, all without a license, by the way. And he's getting way too big of portions. He's wasting away my, oh, our resources. I'm sorry, what? I'm just sick of him always getting whatever he wants when the rest of us don't get that opportunity. I'm sorry, are we still talking about Stuart Little, the mouse? You don't get it. I've waited years, years, to finally have a younger brother. And that day haunts me. It haunts me, Ava. Yeah. That horrible day my parents sat me down and told me I would be getting a brother. I was so excited to finally have a younger brother to play with. We could play soccer. We could wrestle, and I wanted a younger brother specifically. I remember asking, Mom, Dad, I want a little brother. And I should know from there, I was fucked. <laughs> when I came home from school, imagine my surprise to see my brother, a fucking mouse. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm getting really emotional. Yeah, but I can't imagine it's that bad. I mean, how much harm can one mouse cause? How much harm? That fucking rat has ruined my life. First of all, he gets special treatment. I mean, like they treat him like he's a god or something. I'm turning 16 this year and I'm not getting a cart, but that sick fuck has a car, a plane, a boat. You name it, he has it, but I have to wait. It's special treatment, I'm telling you. Okay. When he drives a car and drives through the woods, my parents go, oh my God, so how cute, he's so little. But when I steal a car and drive through a shopping mall, all of a sudden I'm the bad guy. <laughs> I mean, he is small, he can't cause that much damage. You drove through a mall. He causes plenty of emotional damage, Ava. And to top it off, I'm going through puberty? And I smell, it definitely helps, doesn't help my street cred that my brother's a fucking rodent. <laughs> yeah, that's not a great look. And you know it's been a tough journey, like everyone is always like, oh, size doesn't matter, it's about your personality. Well, not in my household. Size matters a lot, apparently. And like, personality really should be the big factor here because he has no personality because his ugly ass car and his weird little outfits. <laughs> I mean, I don't see how his outfits really are an issue. He keeps stealing my fucking socks and using them as sleeping blankets because he's always invited to sleepovers. My mouse brother has more friends than I do. It's sick. That just seems like a you issue. I don't know what that has to do with your brother being a mouse. What else would have caused me to have no friends and a ray of fucking sunshine? Are you like trying to like imply that like, like... I'm not implying anything, I just... I. I'm somehow always in a shadow, even though a shadow's about an inch fucking long, and let's be honest, an inch is far too small. I think we're getting a little off topic. I'm this close to buying a bunch of mouse traps and going to town on the house, I swear to God. Oh, uh, that's not. Our cat has something right trying to eat that son of a bitch. I, I can't even call him a son of a bitch because I don't know who his mom is, that adopted <laughs> piece of shit. Okay, this is getting a little violent. Sorry, my therapist told me I have a bit of an anger problem. Can we change the topic, please? This is a tad triggering for me. Okay. <laughs> so, what do you do for fun? Thank you so much for asking. No one ever seems to care about what makes me, me, you know? I kind of have some niche interests. Mm, let me think. I like to tie my brother's tiny little shoelaces together and watch him fall. Um, sometimes I'll move the cat food near his bedroom so that the cat can like scare the shit out of him. I like watching mousetrap compilations, uh, that kind of thing. So, those all seem kind of related to Stuart. Why the fuck would you bring him up? <laughs> okay, this has been enlightening. Should we even put this in, guys? This got borderline homicidal. Yeah, well, you would be homicidal, too, if you're fucking... Okay, moving on. Thank you so much. Uh, what up? Sorry, whatever your name is. <laughs> Let's get to the next package.